icons, you can see that uh, we have a, a special view in our monastery, uh, the uh, mosaic icons. We are trying to make an open Bible. You can see the icon and the prayer, or the verse from the Bible. Here are the prophets of the Old Testament that said that they have a special prophecy about the coming Messiah, about the coming of Jesus Christ. So here is the icon of Abraham. <coughs> Abraham, the father of fathers, we call it in our Orthodox Church. He is the father of fathers. Yeah. Yes. He said that Jesus Christ said, if you want to translate, Jesus Christ said, your father Abraham rejoiced to see my day. And he saw, and he was very happy. In, in, uh, in the Gospel of John, he told them for the Jews. And here we have the prophet Moses. Yeah. And he also, about the prophecy, about the coming Messiah. And, you, and here is the icon of the prophet David. You know? okay. And here is the prophet Isaiah. Isaiah said, said the, 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 the famous, uh, uh, that, yes, Isaiah said that the Lord will himself will give you a verse that the virgin will have a son and call him Emmanuel, which means that God is with us, you know. And we have other four, four uh, prophets. We have uh, Jeremiah, we have uh, Ezekiel, we have uh, Melchizedek, and we have Micha also. This monastery was built in 1404. It's very old monastery. Mm -hmm. And this monastery destroyed completely during the 2006 war when uh, Israel attacked Lebanon at 12th of July. This monastery was completely destroyed. Second, second Lebanon. Yeah. Lebanon is one. Yes, okay. And we have also, the here, uh, you can see, also. this is our faith. Jesus Christ praying before uh, crucifixion. Mm -hmm. This is the crucifix icon. This is when they took down Jesus from, from the cross. And here is the empty tomb. And here is the resurrection. This is our faith. So we are, we are trying, as I told you, to make an open Bible that the people come and pray or read the, the, the Word of God. And you know that the Word of God, it works directly inside, inside us. Yes, especially we are suffering in this. This is very, as I told you, the steps of Jesus is still alive in this area. So, and you know that uh, the history is repeat himself. During the Second World War, there was a platoon of a Greek and Russian soldier. They were fighting here. And they were uh, also, uh, and they visited uh, Archangel Michael Church, the parish, our parish church, Archangel Michael. And they, uh, they donated, they gave the church some uh, icons. And now we are happy to, to see you, to see the Serbian also here. But we don't like to, to see a war, after all, <laughs> but to see you. And uh, God bless you. We wish you that. Uh, I know that uh, the position of the UN is a very hard and difficult, but uh, you are our, our uh, sons. 
you are our brothers. We are from the same faith. We are from the same uh, church also. So uh, my greetings from this monastery to all the, Serbi to all the Serbian people. Uh, also for the armed forces, for president, for His Holiness, the Patriarch of Serbia, after requesting his blessings, and for His Eminence, the Ministry of Defense, Mr. Bratislav Kasic. We, we were happy when he visited us, and also we welcomed His Eminence, the, the Chief of General Staff, uh, General Lubisha Digovic. So you are welcome. This is your home, and you are between your parents, you are between your family. And uh, greetings from the land of Christ, the land of Christ, to the land of holiness, to the land of the people of Saint Sava in Serbia.